This is such a big box and it's definitely bigger than my potential. Hello guys, welcome to my YouTube channel and my name is KZ. If you're new here, welcome again. Um, today, I'm going to unbox the best vlogging camera that you can find in the market, which is the Sony ZV1. And I'm super excited with this because this is most probably the first camera that I have bought in my life. And without further ado, let's unbox now. It scissors. Show you guys what is inside. Oh, see, this um, that is the camera, and all of those stuff is the accessory. And I will show you guys one by one. So the first one. Wow, my Sony baby. There's an SD card. 64 um, gigabyte and optical glass screen protector. The cleaning utensil for the um, camera to clean the lens or something like that. And this is the back battery charger kit. They say that um, um, this camera can record about um, one hour, so um, every time when the battery is exhausted, you need to change a new one. Flexible tripod. This is a quite famous um, tripod. You lens it, they have also lights. Now, limited edition pouch and windscreen. But then, I, I actually don't like the rainbow colors windscreen because I think that the gray colors one looks better. I think this is a little bit for me. Okay. The shooting grip, which is the VCT SGR1. There's a few buttons there which you can control shooting, recording videos, zoom in and out. This one costs about 250 ringgit and I bought it together with just about 180 ringgit and it is cheaper. I actually thought to buy the camera alone and also um, buy the accessories um, in other shop but then after I calculate and analyze I, I feel that if I buy those accessories and also the camera together it will be much more cheaper than I buy separately so I bought it together okay now let's unbox this Sony baby which I desire for a long time I actually survey um, these cameras and also the G7X Mark II and Mark III and I I just feel to buy this because um, it really suits um, what I should do and I think that Mark II and Mark III um, does have the disadvantages that I don't like much. Undeniable, this G7X Mark II and Mark III is a very good shooting camera but um, for vlogging purposes and also um, just shooting some photos, I think Sony Z1 would be better. So um, if you guys like me to compare um, the Sony ZV1 and also the G7X Mark II and Mark III you can leave in the um, comment section below and I will try to make it if it is possible wow this is just amazing and it is quite simple in the box there's just one camera and there's the charger and this one don't know what is that so I take out the camera first I'm so sorry guys because um, my storage full just now unfortunately I didn't manage to um, record the video just now I'll just show you guys again basically this is the camera it looks like this there's a screen in front and then this camera um, couldn't fix lens since then it is a compact camera the battery door is here so just open it and I insert my battery and also SD card Simple setup. Wow. Oh, 
Oh my god, this camera is good in um, actually you don't need to know many settings and you can just use the default mode if you want and it is just pretty well but then if you want to learn more about this camera you can go and search um, YouTube or whatever channels that um, teach beginners how to use this Sony Z1 so let's take a selfie okay and I will show you guys um, how the photo looks pouch and also the bin screen So now I'll be unboxing this this stuff. Shooting rip. Very small and light. This and so there's a what's here? Multi and you just insert into this mounting hot. So basically it's like this for vlogging. Hello, testing, testing, one, two, three, and I'm now in my room um, testing the audio of Sony ZV-1 and um, this is um, no external audio and just um, the internal audio and with the windscreen and I'd like to try and see how is it. Okay, so let's check it. And it can also become a tripod stand which is like that flexible tripod you lensy flexible tripod it is flexible but at the same time you can feel that the quality is very good you can flex it whatever shape you want you can just mount the camera on it just as the same as this tripod stand so I think that's all for my unboxing video today and if you like my video don't forget to give a thumbs up and also subscribe my channel I will see you in the next video Bye